key elements in the art of working together are how to deal with change, how to deal with conflict, and how to reach our potential. The needs of the team are best met when we meet the needs of individuals, individual persons. Thank you, Sue. Roll call, please. Belt. Here. Boren. Here. Carlson. Here. Decker. Here. Hammond. Here. Hannah. Here. Heidemann. Here. Koth. Here. Kittleson. Here. Matichek. Here. Rinfleisch. Here. Raisler. Here. Sampson. Here. Van Akron. Here. Vanderweel. Here. And Versi. Here. 16 present. We have a quorum. Now if we can all rise, we have Mike Damro here with the uh, Boy Scouts from Troop 804. And if you gentlemen can come forward here and you can lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance. If you guys would like to just all line up on the ledge here, that'd be great. Yep, you can go up there. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good job, guys. Thank you. Thank you, gentlemen. Looking for approval of the minutes of the prior Common Council meeting, President Rinfleisch. I move that we approve the minutes of the previous meeting. Second. We have a motion and a second to approve the minutes under discussion. If there is no discussion, all in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Motion carries. Public forum this evening? Yes, we have one this evening, Milt Storm. Milt, could you give us your home address, please? 1736 Marvin Court, and that's in Sheboygan. And you will have five minutes. Thank you for giving me this opportunity to speak. The things that I would like to speak about this evening are my own facts and my own thoughts, and not necessarily of the organization I belong to, and that is Neighbors Against Drugs. <clears throat> Seven and a half years ago, in 2003, this city council approved us to organize as a group. We are also under the sponsorship of the Sheboygan Neighborhood Pride, Inc., and of the Sheboygan Police Department. <clears throat> so I would like to update this council and the public of our group's activities these past years. In the city of Sheboygan, we have been successful in closing down approximately 100 drug houses and their activities. Along the way, we have gained recognition both statewide and nationally. It was either late 2004 or early 2005, I don't recall. Our NAD group took first place in Wisconsin Rabbits at an awards banquet hosted by the State Community uh, Policing Association. I have a picture here that I will distribute it. Don't worry about mishandling it. I have it mounted in a metal frame on my hangs on my kitchen wall. In October of 2005, our NAD con completed in an international competition where we received second place. Some of the judges that were at, seated at our table at the banquet awards thought that we should have been first place, and I agree. Our NAD is now thinking of starting the community villages in starting their own drug groups to abate drug dealing in their communities. At our last meeting, which is now being held at the Sheriff's uh, Department, one of our members knew somebody over in the Cedar Grove High School, uh, some relative, and we have tentatively contacted the Cedar Grove High School and they have agreed that we will have a public forum there June 2nd at the high school. It'll be about 6.30 in the evening. Uh, it still is tentatively, but I'm leaving the cat out of the bag already ahead of time. It will be much similar to the same thing as the meeting we had at the Rocco Room 
And I think uh, Chief uh, Demogowski did attend. I was not able to attend that meeting. <coughs> Although our group is much smaller now, we still command a huge presence. Our Monday noon meetings are held now in the Sheboygan County Sheriff's Building. They are open to the public. We need public support. And if you'd like to come, we might even seriously think in giving you a job. I'm sure that we can always find some volunteers. So thank you for your time, and if time permits, I will answer any questions. Thank you, Milt. Thank you, Milt. Any other public forum? That would be it this evening. That is all this evening. Under uh, mayor's announcements, I have nothing this evening, so we will move right on to the consent agenda. Consent agenda 3-1 through 3-14, President Rinfleisch. Uh, thank you, Your Honor. Uh, 313, I will pull out separate uh, for a separate motion on that one. Uh, so in the meantime, though, I move to accept and file all ROs, accept and adopt all RCs, and pass all resolutions and ordinances uh, from document 3-1 to 312 and 314. Second. Okay, we have a motion uh, to pull 313, so we're looking at 3-1 through 312 and 314. Alderman Boren. Thank you, uh, Mayor Ryan. I'd also like to uh, pull document uh, 312, and when it's appropriate, I'd like to mo make a motion to hold that, have it lie over to the next meeting. Okay. We can just make a motion now to hold on 312 if you'd like. Thank you. Second. We have a motion to second to hold 312. Uh, all in favor of holding 312, state aye. 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 Opposed? Motion carries. So we'll hold 312. So we are looking now on the consent agenda at 31 <coughs> through 311 and 314. Is there any discussion on those items? If there is none, roll call, please. Belt? Yes. Aye. Born? Aye. Carlson? Aye. Decker? Aye. Hammond? Aye. Hannah? Aye. Heidemann? Aye. Koth? Aye. Kittleson? Aye. Matichuk? Aye. Rinfleisch? Aye. Raisler? Aye. Sampson? Aye. Van Akron? Aye. Vanderweel? Aye. And Versi? Aye. 16 ayes. Motion carries. Now we will go with 313. This is going to be pulled for a separate vote. Alderman Hannah? <clears throat> Thank you, Mr. Mayor. I'd uh, make a motion to uh, to approve the RC with the following friendly amendment. Uh, my amendment would be that all existing facilities that properly applied for and received building permits would be grandfathered in as they exist today. Second. Okay, we have a motion and a second that all establishments that have applied for and had approved a building permit to build a smoking room onto their facility be grandfathered in to any uh, changes that uh, have been adopted in this, uh, in this more uh, complete ordinance, correct? That's correct. Under discussion. So we have that amendment. Okay, there is no discussion. May we have a motion on the amended items? I would move that the amended RC uh, be accepted and adopted. Second. We have a motion and a second to adopt the RC as amended. Under discussion. If there is none, roll call, please. Boren? Aye. Carlson? Aye. Decker? Aye. Hammond? Aye. Hannah? Aye. Heidemann? Aye. Kopp? Aye. Kittleson? Aye. Matichek? Aye. Rinfleisch? Aye. Raisler? Aye. Sampson? Aye. Van Akron? Aye. Vanderweel? Aye. Versi? Aye. And Belt? Aye. 16 ayes. Motion carries. Reports of officers 2, 315 through 327 to be referred. Resolutions introduced 3, 328 through 332 to be referred. Reports of committee 6, 333, by law and licensing, recommending denying taxi cab driver's license number 9024, based upon public safety issues. Alderman Hanna. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Uh, I would ask that, uh, is Mr. Siegel here? Uh, can he be given an opportunity to, to speak? Yes. Could we get a motion on the floor? Sure, just to I would make a motion to, uh, to deny 
uh, based upon the uh, police recommendation. Second. Okay, and uh, this gentleman is here. Would you like to step forward and speak on this issue, sir? You would not? Okay. Is there any further discussion? Alderman Sampson? Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Can we just get a little, I guess, some detail as far as what that recommendation was and why? Wish, uh, wish we could. The, it was a juvenile offense. Uh, it's a closed file. Uh, the police uh, uh, requested that we not approve. Thank you. Was this voted on unanimously to deny by committee? No. Three to one. Okay. Is there any further discussion? There is none. Roll call, please. Carlson? Aye. Decker? Aye. Hammond? Aye. Hannah? Aye. Heideman? Aye. Koth? Aye. Kittleson? Aye. Matichak? Aye. Rinfleisch? Aye. Raisler? Aye. Sampson? Aye. Van Akron? Aye. Vanderweel? Aye. Versey? Aye. Belt? Aye. And Boren? Aye. 16 ayes. Motion carries, 334 by law and licensing, recommending denying taxi cab driver's license number 9038 based upon his failure to include all relevant convictions on the application, the record of violations and public safety concerns. Alderman Hanna. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. I would make a motion that uh, RC 3-34 um, to deny license 9038 um, be passed. Second. We have a motion and a second under discussion. Uh, is Mr. Copeland here? Uh, Mr. Copeland, Mr. Copeland, is Mr. Copeland here? Mr. Copeland had multiple offenses that were not disclosed on his application. Thank you, Alderman. And there was a, under again, discussion? A, a negative uh, recommendation from the police department. Very good. Is there any further discussion? If there is none, roll call, please. Decker? Aye. Hammond? Aye. Hannah? Aye. Heideman? Aye. Koth? Aye. Kittleson? Aye. Matichek? Aye. Rinfleisch? Aye. Raisler? Aye. Sampson? Aye. Van Akron? Aye. Vanderweel? Aye. Versey? Aye. Belt? Aye. Boren? Aye. And Carlson? Aye. 16 exuberant eyes. At least one. Motion carries. Report of Committee 7, 335 by Law and Licensing, recommending denying beverage operator's license number 5479 based upon his failure to include all relevant convictions on his application and his failure to cooperate with the committee, Alderman Hanna. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. I'd make a motion that the RC 3-35 uh, uh, be passed. Second. We have a motion uh, and a second under discussion. Is Mr. Gahigi? Here. Is Mr. Gahigi here? Mr. Gahigi. Uh, he received several invitations to attend the committee and failed to show. Thank you, Alderman Hanna. Any further discussion? There is no further discussion. Roll call, please. Hammond? Aye. Hanna? Aye. Heideman? Aye. Koth? Aye. Kittleson? Aye. Matichek? Aye. Rinfleisch. Aye. Raisler. Aye. Sampson. Aye. Van Akron. Aye. Vanderweel. Aye. Versey. Aye. Belt. Aye. Boren. Aye. Carlson. Aye. And Decker. Aye. 16 ayes. Motion carries. Ordinances introduced 10, 336 through 341 to be referred. Just a, a note on the, uh, on here, uh, 336 states uh, uh, that it's proposed by Alderman Boren. It is actually Alderman Decker. We can make a note of that. Alderman Born? Yes. Okay, you're clear on that one, so, all right. <laughs> okay, so that's 336 through 341. Other matters authorized by law. Attorney McLean. Thank you, Your Honor. 342 is an RO by the City Clerk submitting communication from Sheboygan JCs requesting review and approval of the operating hours for the annual Brat Days Festival at Kiwanis Park from August 4th through 6, 2011. That will be referred to Public Protection and Safety and Public Works. 3-43 is an RO by the City Clerk submitting a communication from Amy Gutierrez, Tourism Director of Sheboygan County Chamber of Commerce, requesting use of services and equipment from the Department of Public Works. Referred to the Committee of Public Works. Three 
Uh, 10-44 is an RO by the City Clerk submitting a communication from Denny Moyer, General Manager of Sheboygan Athletic Club, requesting permission to close Wildwood Avenue on Saturday, June 4, to celebrate the completion of the current phase of the park renovation project and to also place barricades in the middle of Wildwood Avenue just south of VFW Hall. To be referred to Public Protection and Safety and Public Works. 3-45 is an RO by the City Clerk submitting a communication from St. Mark Lutheran Church requesting a refund of 2010 paid property taxes for the property at 607 Erie Avenue. To be referred to risk management. 346 is an RO by the City Clerk submitting a communication from the John Michael Kohler Arts Center making various requests of the City to hold their annual Art Armada on July 4th. Referred to Public Protection and Safety and Public Works. 3-47 is an RO by the City Clerk submitting a communication from Danny Beeman requesting a waiver of the sex offender residency regulation. Referred to Public Protection and Safety. And 3-48 is an RO by the City Clerk submitting various license applications for the period ending June 30, 2011 and June 30, 2012. Referred to Law and Licensing. 3-49 is a resolution authorizing the sale of city-owned property at 1026 Erie Avenue and 712 South Water Street. Referred to city planning. Motion to adjourn. Second. We have a motion and a second to adjourn. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? We are adjourned. Thank you, everybody. Mark.